You see fire extinguishers everywhere you go. They're in every business, community center, schools, places of worship, and occasionally in homes. This deck will give you some pointers and show you what you can do to keep your extinguishers in top shape and save you a few dollars to boot. Let's face it, fire code isn't very exciting. That's why we take the time to learn them and stay up to date. If you have questions, we have the answers. Most extinguishers are pressurized. When you pull the pin and squeeze the handles, the chemical is pushed up the siphon tube and out the nozzle. That's why they should be held upright. Quick checks will tell you if the extinguisher will work. Is the seal and pin in place? Is the gauge in the green? Or is there any other damage? Look for dense rust or corrosion. You don't want the extinguisher to rupture. It's a pressurized vessel and the contents could come out hard and fast. If you've used the extinguisher but the gauge still shows some pressure and you feel some powder left, you still need to service it or it'll let you down next time you need it. Dry chemical extinguishers are by far the most common. They can be used on wood and paper, fuels and oils, as well as electrical fires. They're very versatile. Extinguishers have different classes. It's okay to pause the video once in a while. I'll wait. There's a lot here, and yes, some metals do burn. Extinguishers have pictograms to tell you what types of fires they are designed to fight. Some extinguishers are very specific. If you have some unique hazards like welding areas, computer rooms, or electrical rooms, you will want to ensure the extinguisher is still suited to the hazard. When using an extinguisher, pull the pin, aim at the base of the fire, squeeze the handles, and sweep back and forth. We offer on-site training. This is another great spot to pause and read the points. There's a lot here and I don't want you to miss something important. Keep 911 at the front of your mind. The longer you wait to call, the longer the firefighters take to respond. Time is against you in a fire. Never try to fight a fire if you don't know what to do. Smoke is by far the most dangerous thing you'll face. It's extremely toxic and will take you down before the heat ever becomes an issue. I've shared a lot of information about fire extinguishers and I know you have more questions. Give us a call. We'll gladly answer them.